killed our mother. Brenda? I did. I did. I did. What is happening here? So many plants. It's like a fucking greenhouse. Why are you so pale? I don't go outdoors. Why not? It's too hot and I hate the sun. Then why do you live in Vegas? You know why. Where is she? Do people still go to magic shows? They do. But to your show? Is she? Don't! Don't go in there! I need to see- Yet! I should prepare you. You said she slipped and fell. What happened, Brenda? She slipped and fell. Oh my God. That's ketchup. Oh, okay. I made myself a frittata. She had already been laying into me about my lack of career, a husband, friends, empathy. Which is all somewhat reasonable. Sure, but every day, this is every fucking day. And fuck you, you haven't been here for this past year, two years, I've been taking care of her all by myself. And bringing her plants. Well, I'm a botanist. And I thought it'd be good for her. Make it feel more like a home. Or a rainforest. So what happened? She wouldn't stop watering the pothos plant. And? And? And... That isn't ketchup. No, that's blood. It's mostly blood. Brenda? Where's the body? I told you I killed her. Okay, why? With what? <laughs> why did she vomit? I poisoned her a little, just to knock her out for a few days and get a little breather. But then she attacked me. Why did she attack you? <sighs> what, what are you doing? Needs water. I watered it two days ago. It's dry. But the pothos only needs to be watered once every two weeks. We had one when I was a kid, and it had to be watered every day. Well, it was probably another type of plant. No, it was a golden pothos. And my mother watered it every day, and that plant lived forever. And when she died, <laughs> which that, 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 <coughs> that plant, that same, <sighs> she never killed a plant. Well, you just killed that one. My mother knew plants, and she taught me. She taught uh, Mom, me. Mom, I know. But I know plants. I'm a botanist. That's not a real thing. Oh, look at the lily of the valley. I, it looks like someone tore a hole. It looks like you tore off the whole stem. <coughs> and you know, that that's, that's Okay. I don't want to go to jail. Thank God you're here. 
How did you get here from Vegas in an hour? I was in Brooklyn. You were in Brooklyn? And you didn't tell us? It was very last minute. Well, last minute is okay. Last minute is fine if you pick up the phone. I was busy. Oh, great. So now you're getting work here. You should move to New Jersey. New Jersey? Yeah, I bet a lot of magicians live in New Jersey. Move back east. You know, take some responsibility for your family, our family, or at least tell us when you're already in town. Do you want some coffee? No. Wait, so you're doing a magic show in Brooklyn? No, but... Oh, my God, Billy, you can bring her back. What? Do you remember when Magic Man McGraw came into Mr. Finley's class in the fourth grade? He found a dead fly on the windowsill and he brought it back to life. He put it in ice. He planted it there, defrosted it in his hand, and then it flew away. What? No, wait, what? That's, that's how it works. It's magic. It's not... What? It's not real. But David Blaine brought a pigeon back to life. Fuck David Blaine. No! He found a dead pigeon and he brought it back to life! It wasn't real. Bullshit! I saw it on TV! You can do this, Billy! If... if Blaine can... Fuck Blaine. You are jealous of David Blaine. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. But this is your chance. To what? Show him up. He did a pigeon. You'll do mom. Brenda, you <laughs> poisoned her and then smashed your head in with a frying pan. And I kept smashing it after she fell. <laughs> Oh, shit. It's probably Shirley. Shirley? Mom's neighbor. Fuck off, Shirley! It's the police. Oh, shit. Why would the police... Shirley, that piece of shit cat fucker! Open the door. Just don't let him in. <sighs> hi, Brenda. Oh, hi, Carl. Sorry to disturb you, but we got a few reports of a... A few? <laughs> well... <laughs> Shirley. She said it was pretty bad this time. Yelling, screaming, some sort of banging. <laughs> Isn't that the usual? Is your mother in? Yeah, but of course. She's just a bit decapitated, in incapacitated right now. Incapacitated? Well, I poisoned her, and then I smashed her in the head with a frying pan. Numerous times. <laughs> no, no, Carl, she's resting. It was just one of our usual fights. Some... Sorry if it upset Shirley's cat. It wasn't just Shirley this time, Brenda. Oh? I know times are tough, but, uh, could you try to keep it down? I've tried. We'll try. It's gonna be so much better from now on. Honestly, we're getting a lot of calls now, and, uh, I just hope we're all in a better place by summer. Yeah. My brother is here. Oh. Billy! Hi. I didn't know you had a brother. He lives in Vegas. He's a magician. Oh, wow. Yeah. Do you know David Blaine? No. Too bad. Yeah. All right, well, uh, I'll come back in a bit, check up on things. What? Check in with your mom. I don't want to disturb her if she's resting. But I do need to set my eyes on her, make sure she's okay. I'll circle back in a few hours. All right. We'll be here. I'll be here. Uh, he was going to go out for a bit with Mom. They were going to go out for a walk. Of course. After I circle back. Uh, of huh? course. Billy. Brenda. Mm. Plans are looking good. <laughs> Back. Because he usually sees mom. Did you hear that he liked my plans? I have a plan. You do? I have someone who You can, do. I have someone who can be here soon. Take care of the mess. What about mom? That's what I mean. No! What do you mean, no? Let's bring her back to life! You smashed her head in. I know, but I kind of regret it now. Brenda, I love you sometimes, but I can't bring her back. Uh, we could. We could. Kiss it with. We could try Mama Lemons. You know, why is she still? I saw her on her stoop this morning. She really is quite powerful, Billy. Yes, yes, she is. I'll uh, have another one of my guys pick her up. Jimmy's en route for a full wash and wax. What? A cleanup. 
Maybe we can snap her neck back into place, and then Mama Levins can do her thing. And if that doesn't work, Jimmy can have Max come by, cut up, and discard the body. We tell Officer Carl she went for a walk. We tried to stop her. She never comes back. Wait, Max, Jimmy, who are these people? Who are you? The magician. That's what they call me. Holy shit. Holy shit! But how I've did- I've been working for Nikki Pistoni since we were 15 years old. Why do you think nobody ever found out what happened to the neighbor's cat? Or to little Kimmy? Or to dad? This is so fucking exciting! Oom gan gana patena ma. Oom gan gana patena ma. Oom gan gana patena ma. This chant is the elephant deity. Positive outcomes. Oom gan gana patena. She's still dead. Billy. Okay. Get me some ice. Are you feeling better? Yeah. I just needed some air. We should get back. Officer Carl's gonna show up. I know. Do you think she'll be awake? No. In which case? Max is standing by two blocks away. Okay. Let's go back. I'm really glad that you're here, Billy. Yeah. And no matter what, I do think that things are gonna get better. Maybe.